Alright, Luke, I have a challenge for you. I love challenges. What is it? Well, you know how we always do build challenges and we kind of build in our favorite colors? Yeah, my colors are just so good. Well, I bet you a hundred monies that you couldn't build in one color for an entire build challenge. A hundred monies? I bet you I can. Alright, so for this build challenge, you and me are going to be building with one color and this dispenser is going to choose. Yay, let's see what it is. <gasps> red! Where's cash when you need them? Seriously, please, I don't know how to build with red! You know, red's not my favorite color either, but since cash likes it, I like it. Ugh, okay, fine. Alright, Luke, so before we start, I've actually been trying to test out one of my new inventions, so go step inside and see if it turns you into creative. I'm scared, Mia! I'm scared! It's gonna work, I promise! <laughs> Alright, um, maybe we should not do that and make a circle on the ground. Oh gosh, well... Now that I made this circle, hopefully Luke ah! comes... Luke, are you in creative? I am. It worked. I told you it works. Now it's my turn. Here I go. <gasps> Perfect. All right. I'm in creative and the first color is red. You can only build in red. Easy peasy. All right. Ready, set, go. Whoa, good luck. All right. So for this build challenge, I can only build in red. And hmm, what's red and something that I think is awesome? You know what? I love hearts. So I'm going to build a red heart. So it's time to grab my materials. For starters, I'm going to need some red concrete and I might need some red terracotta as well. If I'm going to build this heart, I need to make sure I outline it in red as well or else I could lose some points for it being in a different color. All right, so it's time to make the outline of my heart. You know, I've built a heart like this in a building competition against Nico before and I ended up winning. So I'm feeling like I have a pretty good chance. All right, make it go in a little bit. Perfect. And then we got to make it go down. Perfect. My heart is made. Now what I'm going to do is fill in the heart with a different red color because I want to make sure this heart is completely red. All right, a little bit red here. Perfect. And now I need to grab some white concrete. All righty, now that I have the white concrete, I'll put this here. And perfect. Look at my little heart. Oh, it's so adorable. But I can't just make a heart. No, that would be too simple. What I'm going to do is grab out my trusty wand and it's time to make this heart a little bit bigger alrighty I'm going to do this and do this then I'm going to come over here and do the exact same thing we're gonna make this into a heart home and it's gonna be fully red because I know how to build with red all right now it's time to fill in these areas perfect all right now that the roof is done it's time to fill it in with some red because this is gonna be the back of the house and we'll replace this area perfect and now I'm gonna finish building the bottom and then we'll start working on the inside all all right, time to fill in the bottom and done. Okay, perfect. It's time to go over here and to make our front door. This is where the front door is going to be and it looks so good. Now, let's grab a red front door. <sighs> I'm so glad mangrove is a thing. Let's grab some more red items because we got to make it look super awesome in there. Now that I have a few red items in my inventory, it's time to fill this place up. And for starters, we're going to have our bed right here. This is going to be our red bed. Now, I was thinking about possibly putting this drum kit down right here since it's red and I think Cash would love this. And now I'm thinking about adding a little bit of a couch area over here. Now, unfortunately, the flooring's gonna be a little bit weird, but that's okay. And of course, we need to have a bathroom, so I'm gonna make the bathroom. I might move the bed and make the bathroom right over here because I feel like it'll look super cool. And look at all these items I can place down. There's the towel rack. Here's some extra towels. And then we'll put the bed over here. This is where the bed will go. And this will be the couch that's in the bedroom, but I'm going to put it right here. And then let's see if we could find a television. All right, I have all the items for a TV. We're gonna put this here and now it's time to build the TV. Perfect. Here's the red bed, the red couch, the television, the drum set, and the little red bathroom. Oh, this is perfect. This is the best heart house I've ever built in my entire life. Look at this. It's all red and it's perfect. And now I can start working on the outside since I have some time. All right, it's time to make a little bit of a walkway. All right, we'll place some blocks here and perfect. This is going to be the little red walkway to the house. And now let's grab some red roses. Alrighty, now we have our little red tulips, which are so adorable. 
Oh, perfect. And then you can walk straight up to the front door that's all red and come into a fully red house. Okay, there is no way that I lost this build challenge. I surely have won this. So it's time to go get Luke and tell him our red house building challenge is over. Luke, Luke. Yeah, Mia. Time is up. The red section of this competition is over. Perfect, I'm all done. I know, me too. And mine is so red. The reddest you've ever seen. Everything I have is red. All right, Luke. Well, can I come over and see your build first? Yeah, come take a look. Whoa, look at this red block. It just looks like a red block. I know. It depends on what's on the inside, though. I decided what I was going to do is put all my favorite red things inside of one red block. Huh, okay, well, I'll let myself... Whoa, this is so cool. I've got everything I love that's red. Apples, lots of apples. As you can see, look at the barrels. They're filled to the brim. Oh my gosh, Luke, this is actually really good. What the cheese? And a bunch of plushies around my bed. I got some red paint. I'm working on some new paintings. Some towels to clean up my messes. And then the drums. A bunch of, bunch of, bunch of, bunch of, bunch of, bunch of. Hey, did you just touch my drum set? This is mine. Ugh, okay, well. Luke, this is actually really good. I honestly thought it was gonna be kind of poopy. Poopy? What? Hey! No, I got towels for messes. All right, Luke. Well, I guess it's time for your score. How'd I do? Luke, I'm gonna give this build a 9 out of 10. <gasps> Yay! I think it's pretty cool, though. Lots of wet stuff. Yeah, no, this is really good, Luke, but mine's gonna blow you out of the water. Well, let's go see it then. All right, let's go. All right, Luke, are you ready for greatness? So ready, let me see. Here it is. Whoa, <gasps> is it a heart-shaped house? Yes, it's a red heart-shaped house that kind of looks like a hot dog from the side. Hey, don't worry, I'm looking in from the front. It looks just like a heart. Yay, and I made a little red walkway, so when you walk up, you feel like you're at Willy Wonka. Chocolate Factory. I love this. It looks so cool. Can we see inside? Yep, feel free to go inside. Wow. Oh my goodness, you got a bunch of red stuff too. Yep, and I made a little toilet area because everyone needs a toilet. I forgot a toilet. <gasps> we have the same drum set. Hey, don't touch my drum set. Don't touch my drum set. Get off of it, Luke. Oh, sorry. Okay, fine. I'll watch TV. Perfect. All right, Luke. Well, since you really like my heart house, what do you you rate it. Your house is way cooler shaped than me. I'm gonna have to give you a 10 out of 10, Mia. 10 out of 10? So that means I win the first round? Yeah, but I'm gonna win the second one. Don't you worry. All right, Luke. Well, I guess it's time for round two. Yay! All righty, Luke. You know what time it is. Time for you to press the button. All right, all right. Don't rush me. I just can't wait. Blue! What? That's so exciting. There's so many cool blue things we could build. Well, technically it's Scion, but I'm just gonna consider it as blue because I like blue. Blue's way better. And Scion's like kind of a blue. Yeah, so as long as you use Scion in your builds, then it's still gonna count, okay? Perfect. Okay, time to get busy. All right. Bye, Luke. Bye, Mia. All right, Scion. I don't know of many Scion things, and I know that Nico is light blue, but I'm gonna build Nico out of Scion. I know, Nico's not gonna be happy, but it's still kind of blue, so let's get started. So I'm actually very good at building people. So what I'm going to start off with is the legs. Perfect. Now I need to get my special wand so I'm able to build this correctly. Now I need to build this quickly because ideally I would like to build something inside. All right, perfect. And the legs are done and they're a little tall. So I think I'm gonna make this into the body. All right, perfect. Nico's onesie is coming together. Now it's time to do the body. So what I'm going to do is build this up a little bit higher and then I'm going to fill it in the same way I just did. Alrighty, perfect. And I think I made it a little too tall. So let's cut that out. All right, Perfect. Now it's time to build the arms. All right, I'll do this and this. Perfect. Wow, Nico's so easy to build. It's because he wears a onesie all the time. I can just build him so easily. Perfect. And now it's time to work on Nico's head and face. All right, perfect. I have all the items. Now let's even this out right here. Perfect. And now it's time to build Nico's head. All right, the shape is now done.
on. Now all I have to do is add the hair and the goggles, of course. All right, so how would I like to do this? Should I add the hair on the outside? I'm thinking so. No, I have to add the hair on the inside because if I add the hair on the inside, then I'll be able to build the goggles. All right, I'll build the goggles right here. They're gonna be pretty far down on his head, but I don't think that matters. And then what I'm going to do is instead of having the hair showing from behind, I'll place some scion wool and then I'll put glass over it. Perfect. All right, now it's time to make Nico's eyes. Nico's eyes are usually hidden by his hair. So I'll make his hair right here. Perfect. Look at Nico and his hair is a little bit in his eyes, which I think helps work a little bit more. All right, perfect. Now it's time to work on the rest of Nico's head. So for starters, what I'm going to do is I'm going to fill this all in with brown concrete. Now that this is all brown concrete, I'm going to make it look like the hair is kind of falling on his face a little bit. We'll do a little bit back here. I can't really do too much back here, but I can do more on the side. Perfect. Nico looks perfect. I know he looks a little silly right now, but I tried my hardest and I really made sure to utilize Scion. Now I need to decide if I can build a little house inside of the back of Nico. In Square City, Nico has a little home inside of his head. So I'm going to build a little home in here. And then I think I'm going to make it lead upwards into the head. And then I'm going to make some room for myself. This is going to be awesome. And I have so much room to work with. But for starters, I'm going to head back down here and it's time to get some Scion furniture. Alrighty, so up here I think is going to be the bedroom. So I'm going to add the bed in the corner right here and then I'm going to add a few plushies by it. So cute. I think I'll put it by the side of the bed just so it doesn't interfere too much. And now I'm going to add a little couch over here. Perfect. And let's see if we can add a few more things. Alright, I've decided I want to add one more plushie. In fact, I might put the plushies on the couch. I feel like that'll look super cute. Alright, perfect. They're all on the couch and now I'm going to be able to add in my little drum. So if I want to play the drums, I can play it right here. Actually, I'll put it right there in that corner. And then while I'm playing the drums, I'll add this in here for privacy while I'm sleeping. Perfect. All right, it's time to grab some ladders and work on the bottom floor. All right, now that I have my ladders, I'm just going to place these in here so I'm able to get up to my top floor. And then I'm going to grab a secret trap door. All right, now that I have my secret trap door, I'm going to place this right here. And then I'm going to head back down. That's going to be the bedroom. And it's now time to work on the small bathroom. I love making the bathrooms. Look at these cool things I can add. All right, so this will be where the toilet is. And then I'll put some towels down over here in this corner. Perfect. There's so many towels. This will be the little storage area for the bathroom. So I'll have a plunger there. I'll have all the towels. And I think my scion build's done. Everything's pretty scion in here. Oh, this is perfect. It's starting to look immaculate. I better go tell Luke that the scion section of this building competition is over so we can score each other. Luke, Luke. Yeah, Mia? Time is up. The scion section of this building competition is over. Perfect timing. I'm done. Me too. All right, Luke. Well, do you want me to come over and look at your scion build first? Yes, please. Yes, please. All right. Here I come. Oh, gosh, Luke. Guess what it is. Let me take a wild guess. Is this a build filled with all of your favorite scion items? No, not this time. Oh, well, then what is it? Welcome to my doctor's office. Wait, doctor's office? Whoa, look at this. Yeah, I got everything you need. This is really cool, Luke. Wow. Yeah, I got all the doctor's beds. We got all the fancy medical stuff. We can take care of so many people in here. And I really like the art you decided to put on the walls as well. Oh, yeah, you know, the patients need something to look at. Well, Luke, this is actually pretty good. I'm glad that you really utilized blue and scion. I know, I put blue everywhere. Well, Luke, I really like this build and I think it's amazing. But the specific color was Scion. So I'm going to have to deduct a point. But you said it was blue too. That's true. But it's also Scion. So I'm only going to take off a quarter of a point. Okay, I guess that's fair. Which means I'm going to give you a 9.75 out of 10. Hey, that's pretty good. Okay, I'm glad you like it. This was awesome, Luke. But do you want to come check out my build now? Yes, please. Let's go see it. Yay. All right, Luke. Here it is. Is. You built Nico? I did. I built Nico wearing Scion. Oh my goodness. This looks so cool. I know. I even built his goggles. His goggles are literally my favorite part. I know. They're literally the best ever. Those look so cool. I just want to climb inside them. I'm going to climb inside them. No, Luke. You can climb inside the back. What are you doing? Get out of the goggles. I'm in the goggles, Mia. What are you doing? 
exploring. I'm sorry, I was just exploring. All right, Luke. Well, let's go inside the back so I can show you the little house. There's a house, too? This is the bathroom area. This is so cool. All the cyan towels, too. And let's go up to the bedroom. Okay, perfect. Whoa, look at this. Hey, privacy, please. Oh, sorry. I'll just play my drum kit. <laughs> Luke, you're not playing the drums. Look at all the plushies on the couch. The plushies inside of you. Look, Luke. Oh, wait, what about this one? Hey, it's a baby. Wait, what about me? You too. Oh, my goodness. Okay, Luke. Well, what do you think about my Scion build? You definitely use the color better than me. Mia, it's got to be a 10 out of 10. Whoop, 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 whoop. Party at Mia's place. I got a 10 out of 10. Hey, let's go. Come on. Dance party. Dance party. I'll play the drum. All right, Luke. Well, I guess it's time for round three. Surely I'll win this one. Yeah, we'll see. All righty, Luke. Guess what time it is. Stop for round three. Let's do this, Luke. A bop. Yellow. We're shady when you need them. Seriously? Oh, my goodness. What do I build? Uh... Well, I already have an idea. And the timer starts now. Go, go, go. Oh, I need to hurry. All right. Since we got the color yellow, I've come up with a genius idea. Since I spend most of my days in my lab, I'm going to be building a bee because I do a lot of experiments on them. I want to figure out how they make honey. Anyways, it's time to get my bee materials. All right, I'm going to need some brown concrete. Of course, I'm going to need some yellow wool. I'm also going to need one piece of light blue wool. I'm going to need some black wool. And I think I'm going to need some white concrete. All righty, it's time to start up my bee. Now, obviously, my bee cannot be touching the ground. That would not be okay. So now I'm going to proceed with my bee. So I'm going to start off with building the legs. I feel like that's going to be the best bet for the bee. And I think it has six legs since it's an insect. Perfect. Here is my bee base. Now it's time to build the actual bee. All right, the bee is done. Just kidding. It's time to get my wand. All right, I'm going to click both of these corners and I'm going to set them as yellow wool. All right, they're now set as yellow wool. Look, it's already looking like a bee. I actually might make this bee a little bit bit bigger, but that's for future reference. For now, let's try to finish the bee off as is. So I leave some room inside of the bee. I am just going to make walls rather than filling it in with completely yellow wool. Alrighty, perfect. Oh, my bee is looking so cute. I'm gonna make my bee just a little bit taller. Does this look good? I think it looks good. All right, let's continue. Perfect. And now it's time to cover up the top. Now you guys are probably wondering, why doesn't this look like a bee yet? Well, it's because I haven't made the eyes, nor have I made the stripes of the bee. So let's do that now. One eye done. Now it's time to make the other. And boop. Look at my bee's eyes. It is so adorable. Now it's time to make the antennas. All right. Bee antennas. I think it goes like this. Perfect. All right. And there's one more thing I want to add to the bee that isn't typically on bees, but I think it'll make it look adorable. Ah! Look at my bee, it's flushing. Okay, now it's time to work on the rest of the bee. I need to stop getting distracted. So, as you all know, bees typically have black stripes. However, in Minecraft, their stripes are actually brown. So, that's what we're going to be making them today. We'll do that, and then we go over here, and we do this, and then we go to the top, and we do that. And now we have to go on the bottom. You can't leave any place unmarked. All right, perfect. Look at my little bee. All right, now, Ted. Technically, due to gravity, the bee should not be floating like this. It has to have wings or else, technologically speaking, it's not really flying. So let's build the wings. Now, hopefully I can build these wings correctly. I've experimented on a lot of bees and I better be able to get these right. Alrighty, this looks like a good amount of wing. Now I just need to figure out how I would like to do this. Oh, perfect. Okay, now I just have to copy this wing onto this side. All right, time to fill in the wings. Ah, look at my bee. Oh, it is so adorable. Look, it's flying away, doing bee things. Now, the last thing I have to make is a stinger. All right, my bee is officially done. This bee looks absolutely magnificent. All right, now that my bee is done, I think the last thing I'm going to add is a yellow flower. I feel like a yellow flower is really going to bring this bee together. And I have just the right amount of time. All right, it is now time to build my little daisy for my little bee. So I think I'm going to build it like this and start off with the stem. And then I'm going to put some leaves on it. 
it. And now it is time to build our flower. Oh, look at our little flower. Oh, it is so cute. And I think our bee is really gonna like it. It's a little flower for our bee. All right, bud. It looks like time's about up. And I think all of my yellow builds are looking magnificent so far. So it's time to go tell Luke that the yellow building competition is over. Luke, Luke. Yeah, Mia? Time is up. The building competition is over. Oh my goodness. This better be the round I win. Okay, Luke. Well, I went pretty crazy this round. So I guess we'll have to wait and see. All right. Are you ready to see greatness? Oh, Luke. I was born ready to see greatness. Okay, beat your eyes. <gasps> Luke, is this a little school bus? Yeah, this is the one we used to go to school on. Oh my goodness. Luke, this is really good. I like this. Yeah, I think it's pretty cool. I put so many details on the outside. Oh my goodness, it took forever. Luke, this is absolutely, positively, 100% magnificent. That was a lot of big words. I hope that means good. Yes. Okay, good. That's all I was looking for. Alrighty, Luke. Well, I guess it's time for me to rate your school bus. Yeah, how'd I do? Well, Luke, you did a really good job using yellow, so I'm gonna give this a perfect score. 10 out of 10. Yay! Let's go! Hey, don't get too excited yet, bub. I have my build now. Fine, let's go see it. Yay! Alrighty, Luke. I think I built the cutest thing ever. You built me? <laughs> uh, Luke, get over here and look at my build. Okay, let's see. Whoa! You built a Minecraft bee. Yes, it's a Minecraft bee. Buzz, buzz, buzz. And a flower. Yes, this is the bee's flower friend. And look, I even added some flush to make it all cute and happy. This thing looks adorable. I know. Look at it. I love it so much. I actually wouldn't change a single thing about this, Mia. I think you also get a perfect score. Wait, so if I add up all of my perfect scores, that means I win the build competition. Uh, I'll win the next one, Mia. It's just this time. If you want to watch more videos of my brother Luke and I, then click one on the screen right now and also please subscribe it helps out a ton bye, bye guys, guys.